Let's make popcorn with lasers. Making popcorn with a laser was featured in the 80s film Real Genius with actor Val Kilmer. I'll be using two pocket one watt blue lasers. This one in my hand. And this one positioned in a vise. These will be trained on this kernel of corn. In order for the heat of the laser light to be properly distributed in the kernel, it will need to be spun. I will use a DC motor out of a CD slash DVD drive powered by a 9 volt battery with its speed limited by a variable resistor known as a potentiometer. To attach the kernel of corn to the motor spindle, we'll use hot melt glue. We take the end of the kernel and apply a bit of hot melt glue to it, like so. Then we take the kernel and attach it to the spindle with its top up, keeping it fairly well centered and making sure there's not too much glue which would impede laser light to kernel heat transfer. We also need to remove any trailing thread of hot melt glue to prevent it from tangling in the spindle. Now we must align the laser in the vise such that its light falls fully on the kernel. like that. Then with it properly aligned we can go ahead and zoom into the kernel and watch as it heats up and pops. Who would like some popcorn? If you want popcorn let me know in the comments. That lasers could actually pop popcorn was tested and confirmed in the television show known as Mythbusters where they popped a kernel of corn in a university lab using a 10 watt laser what is unique about my video demonstration is that it is being performed on a home workbench with relatively inexpensive lasers that are available online. Let me focus this kernel a bit better and get it spinning. I have the motor speed set so low that I need to give it a bit of a nudge to get it going. Now as we can see the kernel is fairly well positioned and that it is not wobbling too much as it spins around. So we turn on the first laser and then the second laser and train it on the kernel like so and let it heat up. It has to get to 300 degrees Fahrenheit, which is 150 degrees Celsius, so the lasers need to remain on it for a bit while it heats up. And there you go! laser popcorn. Let me turn off the motor here and there it is. Now it is attached by the hot melt glue but I can remove it so that we can examine it a bit closer and see that yes we have popped a kernel of corn with lasers on a home work bench. If you enjoyed this video you can use the share address on screen to tell others about it via Twitter, Facebook, blogs, forums, email, or other means. Don't forget to tell me if you want popcorn in the comments. Thanks.